Treatment without drugs and operations for frozen shoulder, frozen shoulder, periarthritis of shoulder, painful shoulder syndrome as the term goes, is a stuck shoulder. This joint consists of a ball, the humeral head, and socket, the glenoid. Normally, it is one of the most mobile joints in the body. When the shoulder is frozen, the joint has become stuck and its movement is limited. Such patients have painful movements at shoulder. Restricted movements is another feature. Common complaints registered are, cannot lift arm up to 90 degree, cannot wear clothes easily due to painful movement at shoulder, cannot comb hairs, severe pain in shoulder during sleep, and disturbed routine activities for working individuals. How does it start? Many patients do not have an obvious reason. Few say I am diabetic, hence it is considered as primary side effect of diabetes. Few have history of lifting heavy weight. Some have an accidental injury to joint. Sports injury is another cause. Systemic illness such as rheumatoid arthritis, stiff shoulder after fracture at shoulder joint, idiopathic unknown, etc. Could be possible causes. What happens? In a frozen shoulder, the capsule has become inflamed and scarring develops. The scar formations are called adhesions. As the capsule's folds become scarred and tightened, shoulder movement becomes restricted and moving the joint becomes painful. Treatments available for frozen shoulder. Acupuncture is best known treatment. Painkillers, anti-inflammatory drugs, exercises, etc. Treatment do not help in long term. Mobilization of arm under general anesthesia is another treatment, but the recurrence is high. Surgery being another choice, but not usually done. Now a day, many patients approach us for acupuncture. What acupuncture does reduces inflammation by stimulating the release of immunomodulatory and vascular factors. These are neuropeptides, decreased shoulder stiffness and improved range of motion and mobility by enhancing blood flow to the area. Stronger circulation of blood in the shoulder area improves nutrient delivery and reduces pain sensation, enabling you to move your shoulder more freely without feeling pain. How do acupuncture differ from other treatments? Treatment without drugs and operations. Acupuncture involves treatment with thin filiform needles. Finding out the underlying cause so as to have deep tissue repair is the mainstay of acupuncture treatment. Tongue, pulse, and nail diagnosis along with local inspection of the shoulder helps correct treatment methods to apply. Correct technique to needle will give quick results. Cupping, draining heat from affected channels brings good results. Acupuncture points are good in improving local circulation of joint, improve immunity, reducing inflammation, governing hormones, and improve water metabolism. Hence, the majority patients witness a thorough effect helping them find it completely recovered. Magic of the needle. Few acupuncture points help drain heat around joints that helps mobilize the stuck joint immediately in the first treatment session. Hence, a magical outcome. Further treatment helps deep tissue healing. Few interesting cases. A female patient at our Mumbai clinic has stuck shoulder for a year. She did physio, took intraarticular steroid injections. MRI suggested tear, but she was reluctant for surgery. Acupuncture made her pain free in short time. Treatment for two months intermittently saw her completely well. A patient approached us within two, three days after his shoulder was stuck. After a single session of acupuncture, his shoulder movements came back to normal. After four years, he again had frozen shoulder, but on another arm, the recovered shoulder was still fine. This proves long-term benefits of acupuncture.